taste of fate can place someone in a strange place so sudden so unexpected oh in a desolate place you were left so confused You guys in your apartment, I need to get together. No, 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 no. We like it here. Sister, how can you get us a new apartment without informing us first? I am sorry, but the truth is, you guys are no longer safe here. And in due time, I will explain the details to you. But right now, just go get your things, let's leave. How can you say that? Alex, please just shut up and go get your things. Come on. I really didn't mean to hear, okay, please. Just trust me on this. Get your things and let's leave here now, please. Please. Abu? Yes, Oga. Was that Cheta driving out? Yes, Oga. And who was he driving out? Uh, Oga, the girls, Oga. Did you see them carry any luggage into the car? Yes, Oga. And you have no idea where they are going to? I, well, I, Oga, I don't know. Alright. 
Where we at? Your new home. I hope you like it. Good. So why don't you guys take those boxes in um, and make yourself comfortable? Sir, I think the boxes are safe. of it is that you didn't even allow us to say goodbye to mom and dad. So how do you want your mom to look at us? At being ungrateful? I understand how you feel, Molly. But um, in due course, I'll explain to my mom and I'm sure she will understand. Please. Listen, Jetta. We are no babies. You can't just be moving us around with the story of trying to protect us without telling us who or what you're protecting us from. I understand how you feel, but I will tell you everything you need to know when the time is right. And when is that time going to be right? When? Soon. Alice. Sorry. Did you take the, bo uh, the box out from the wardrobe? <gasps> what do you mean? I kept the box on the bed beside your bag. Did you bring it? Yeah. I can't find it. Ah! I can't find it though. Uh -uh. You mean you didn't bring that box? Wait, sir, hey. you left my box in that house. Hey, so that please, you have to go back. Calm and down, try calm down, calm down, calm down. Okay, why don't you guys relax and I'll bring this box over. But I'm going to work. No, let's go now. Let's go and bring the box. Must we go now? Yes, no, 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 immediately. Okay. Like right now. Okay, ladies, let's why go. don't you guys settle that while I take her together? Yes. We'll be back. Yes, thank you. Thank you. I didn't see it. I'm really sorry, okay? Please forgive me. I didn't mean to yell at you.
Check. Let me let me get something inside the living room. I'll be with you in a minute, yeah? I didn't see the box. I've seen it. Where did you see it? I saw it in the main house. Maybe Nosa took it while she was uh, maybe she saw it while she was playing. Oh, I took it inside. Thank God. So this is the box now. Yes. There's peace. Yes. I left it. into the house a few moments ago. You didn't open this gate for anyone and you didn't see anyone enter this compound. Abu, you have been sleeping. You left my gate open. Good afternoon. Did you see anyone on your way coming here, leaving this compound? No, sir. Thank God you found it. I would have been dead if you didn't. Oh, really? Cha, God. Whoa, whoa, whoa. You, girls, what is really in this box that is so important that you have to drag me back to the house and back here again? Um, uh, Mama beads. Mama old beads. <laughs> yes, yes, Mama. Yes. Mama's beads. Mama's beads. <laughs> mm. Yes, our beads. <laughs> oh, all right. Yes. Okay. Now that we have the box, at least uh -huh. there is peace uh, in the class. Yes. Yes. I have to run now. <laughs> Then I'll see you guys after work tomorrow. Is that okay? okay. okay. <laughs> You'll be a big sister. Take care of them, okay? Bye. 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 Only the look on his face said it all. Alice, Monica, hmm? if you ask me, I think it's better we open up. Let's tell Jada the truth. He needs to know the truth. After all, he has only proven himself trustworthy. Why are we hiding the truth from him? Let's tell him about this. If you ask me, that's what I, 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 I feel. Yes, ma'am. 
I came back home and Nasa told me that Alice and her sisters moved out. Why? Well, I just felt that the Biku wasn't too comfortable for them anymore, so I got them a better apartment somewhere else. Huh. I offered to let them move in here with us, but Cheta refused the offer. Cheta, is that true? Well, uh, that isn't exactly true, correct? In all sincerity, yes, he made the offer, but it came late because I had already paid for that new apartment and it was a non-refundable payment, so... I wish we had a discussion earlier before you took this. Well, this is done already. Covering everything Magnus stole from us. But our major problem, or should I say our main obstacle, is Cheta, your brother. Cheta? Yes, of course. Let's take him down and out of our way. How could you say such a thing? Don't you know he's your brother? What do you suggest we do to him then? Since he has easy access to getting the documents. Let's include him in our plans. Besides, he is family. Dad, are you serious? Cheta? If we let Cheta in on our plan, he will jeopardize it. Have you forgotten who Cheta is? I've not forgotten. But I can't see Cheta choosing a stranger over his father. So. Meanwhile, I called Monica and she gave me a new address. That's a very good way to start. Now, you know what you do? You send the boys there first thing tomorrow. But tell them that they have to be very careful. No one must see them. Not even the girls. Did I make myself clear? All right, then. man I told you stole some document of a company I started with my money. Oh yeah, um, Chief Magnus is a friend of old. I remember him. And what about him? Cheta, I am this close to recovering everything Magnus stole from me. But there's a problem. Which is? You are the only one standing between me and those documents. Your friend Alice is Magnus' daughter. Well, <clears throat> see that, uh, I've always known that you're still in this quest to recover or to find Magnus and recover the company documents. I've also known that you have actually found out a long time ago that Alice is, is Chief Magnus' daughter. Yes. Um, I didn't want to say anything. I didn't want to push it. I wanted it to come out of you to write me. Cheta, so you knew all along that Alice was Magnus's daughter and you decided to 
Keep such information away from your father. Since my father that I know too well is a block of testing, money, hungry, murder. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay, Alonso. Alonso, it's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Well, like I was saying before, I was really interrupted by this book. You don't expect me to give away my friend easily to you like that. That will be jeopardizing her, her life. And for the record, at least my friend has no documents as relates to that company. And if you both would excuse me, sir, and boy, I've got important things to do with my time. Excuse me. Dad, yes, sir. this is not your blood. You think so? I know so. No DNA test needed.
Is there something we should know? I just have to take you to some medicine. You and your sister. Don't worry about your sister. I will call the police and, and I will report this case. We'll take it up from there. But please, let me take you people out now first. No, tell me what is going on. What is after our lives? What is going on? Who killed Sarah? Who killed my sister? Talk to me. What is going on? They got a vital information. We now know that Alice has the documents. I knew those documents were in that box. I will do everything within my powers to lay hands on those documents. No one can stop me. You have to keep your eyes. Tell the boys to keep their eyes on Jetta. And Alice. Congratulations. For what? Sarah has been murdered. Public special announcement. This is to inform the general public that the person whose photographs appear here on the screen is declared wanted by the Nigerian police force. That whoever has any useful information about her should contact the Nigerian police force with a reward of 5 million naira. Sign Nigeria Police Relation Officer. Besides, she's afraid to my neighbor. When I 
tell someone in the TV about the incidents that she committed and the huge amount of money involved. I decided to report the information to you. Alright, one girl, with such amount of money, with such amount of money that is involved, what did they do with that kind of money? <laughs> Bros, when I get to the bridge, I'm out for against my instructions. I thought you were desperately in need of that document. Not at the expense of losing a son. How dare you give an order on your brother's life? I did that to please you. Oh God. Now listen to your stupid self. How can killing my own son please me? Do you have any idea how much I spent to train that young man? Do you? For the murder of Miss Sarah Osita. And attempted murder of your son, Jota Johnson. What? So you two killed Sarah? And tried to kill my son, Cheta? Hey! Officers! Uh, please, where is my son? Is he alright? No matter. It's going to be worse. <laughs> I need to talk to my lawyer. You have to remain silent. Anything you say will be against you in the court of law. I need to talk to my lawyer. You have to remain silent. Anything you say will be against you in the court of law. What is happening there? Abusa, I am willing to follow you to the station, but I need to see my son. son Take me to my son. It's only God. It's son. only God that will judge you. I know Adozia was capable of a lot of things. 
intention to hurt you. I didn't send those boys to kill you. I only sent them to retrieve the documents. That's all. Chief. You mean you killed Sarah? My sister because of a man document. Chief, how could you? You would have asked me for that document and I would have gladly given it to you instead of killing my sister. Chief, how can you kill somebody? How can you take a life that you cannot give? How can you, Chief? Wait, Johnson, what document are you talking about? The document that my late... The document that my late father left in my care. I didn't even know how she got to know about it. My sisters and I found out about the documents when we are still staying at your house. And no one else knows about it. I'm just wondering how she got to know about it. Um, Chief Johnson, I don't know why you're so keen about getting those documents. Well, be that as it may, I want to repeat what I said the first time you brought this up. I will not release the document to my company, to you or to any other person. You are an ingrate. I helped you set up that business. It belongs to me. I will have those documents whether you like it or not. Um, well, um, Johnson, when I came to you that I had a business idea, needed your financial assistance, you helped me as a friend. We, were, we never had any agreement that I was going to hand my business over to you when it started booming. There was nothing like that. Chief, good afternoon. Um, listen, Johnson. If you want me to pay back the money you gave me to set up my business, I will do that. As for my business document, that will be over my dead body. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now, Johnson, it has got come to this. Or I'll, I'll wipe out your entire family. Johnson, it has not come to this. Please put away the gun. Chief Johnson, please, whatever you want, my husband will, will give it to you, please. It's, yes, I will give you the documents. This house, anything. Please, let my family leave. Now, go inside and get those documents. I am giving you two minutes to do that. Else, I'll kill your wife and come for you and your daughter. God, Chief! Yes, I remember. I remember vividly that day you came to my house and you asked my father to give you those documents. But he refused. I also remember you telling him that if he refused to surrender the documents, that you're going to have us all killed. Eh? My God! My God! This man killed my mother! Promise me you will not laugh at me if I tell you. 
I cross my heart. Alice, I love you. I'm not kidding about it. This woman is making it up to Can't eat. 